TV in the place to be, man. Yo, go ahead, hit the like button, man. Go ahead, subscribe if you haven't already, man. We finna go ahead and get into it. Today, man, we talking about Jay Prince. And the reason why folks is mad about Jay Prince right now, man. They mad at him. They mad at Jay Prince Jr. They mad at the whole Prince family um, entirely, you know. They saying he has something to do with the takeoff situation, you know. Not Jay Prince, Jay Prince Jr., you know. Jay Prince pretty much, he came out with a statement right after the situation saying, you know, he's slow to, he's he's quick to listen and slow to speak. Um, whoever it was can't hide behind him, all types of stuff. Like, you know, this is just a very, very long written paragraph. And now he's coming to, like, whenever he was on the million dollars worth of game situation and shortly after whenever he's, have, he's having, like, a back and forth with also on the internet, you know, they kind of revealing their hand. Jay Prince and them, they dog, they it seemed like they telling, or at least, yeah, it seemed like they telling. I don't know how to go any other way to see about that because it's like, how do y'all have certain information about things going on? Why y'all quick to say, oh no, they did it. The dude over there who did this and that, they they did it. And y'all saying y'all y'all tied in the streets to some degree, you know? It kind of kind of looking real flip floppy in, in my eyes, and um. It just kind of, it just really looks real weird. You got Jay Prince um, talking about the situation, making threats to Offset um, while on the million dollar worth of game interview. And Wallow and Gilly, they don't say nothing. You know, they just sitting over there. Wallow over there, you know, he looking, he, he looking at ants on the ground. And Gilly, you know, Gilly, he just, he just overexcited to be over there with Jay Prince. Um, So, you know, it was just it, it was just kind of a real real bad looking situation in my eyes. Um, even how Jay Press Jr. was kind of interjecting and talking about things that um, you know, real real like just just how he was just talking just kind of seemed like he was real condescending and they tried to you know come in numbers. Mike Mike Prince, I understand where he was coming from whenever he was talking about okay, you know. Uh, um, um, you know, we're, they're talking about it was basketball. It wasn't dice. It was basketball. You know, I'm just kind of janky for the situation to turn how it did. You know, but it's kind of was Jay Prince the one trying to steal the narrative, you know, saying somebody had the gun. They were doing something. Um, and um, Mike Prince also, he also did say, I guess, you know, what's the name? Swung, uh, I guess a Migo band swung on, swung on somebody and that pretty much potentially started the fight. But um, you know, we already kind of knew that. You know, we talked. I talked about that in my last video. But um, one thing that did kind of stick out too was the fact that um, the girl who got shot, she, her dad knew knew them. So I know Sadie Nash brought this up in one of his videos. But like, um, her dad knew the folks from Mob Ties. So it's kind of crazy that you know. He let his daughter go, and for some reason, he let his daughter go to a party, like, or he was cool with his daughter going to a party at this time, or however that kind of transpired. Like, I wouldn't necessarily want my daughter to be going to no private party at this time with all these local people, like, and, you know, possibly celebrity people, and because potentially, and especially in Houston, where the, everybody can keep their guns, like, what, like, it don't make no sense because something could just happen at any given moment, and, and it did. And she got hit in the crossfire in the head. So, you know, um, it didn't seem like Jay Prince was trying to necessarily defend anything in that situation about what happened to her or, or explain that. But he was definitely trying to, like, talk about the takeoff situation. So it definitely seemed like they're trying to uh, uh, hold on to certain narratives and run with those and move with those um, versus, you know, actually explain things in the different ways they want to. They They... You know, they kind of they kind of have said everything that the media has said, you know, um, and, you know, it's just it's just getting real, real weird at this point. I feel like Jay Prince doesn't seem like it, it kind of seemed like they've been telling they got somebody who might be an informant, um, something along those lines, man. Y'all definitely let me know how y'all feel, man. This TP in the place to be, man. Y'all stay out the way. Y'all get me in the next one, man. Um, Y'all hit the like button, subscribe button, notification bell. And y'all definitely let me know how y'all feel about that, man. Did y'all watch the million dollars worth of game, uh, uh, Jay Prince, you know, interview? Because if y'all did, y'all let me know how the, how y'all like that one. If y'all if y'all like that one, and I'm talking about the one with the Prince family, and when you know, the recent one. 
Y'all definitely let me know if y'all watched that one. Y'all let me know what y'all feel about how y'all feel about it in the uh, comment box if you did. If you haven't, y'all definitely go over there and check that video out and then come back and go ahead and hit the like button or definitely uh, go drop in a comment in the comment box about how you feel. Um, and until next time, man, I'm going to get at y'all on the next one. Y'all stay out the way. And until next time.